Hey guys, what's up? It's been a couple of days since we've talked. You may or may not be able to hear me right now. Probably got a lot of background noise and I apologize for that. Don't know if you can see it in the background or not. My big old monitor back there is uh, <laughs> running a uh, FSCK file system check on one of my hard drives in my very, very old computer. Uh, one of them that I haven't turned on in, man, it's, it's easily been a year, maybe more. Uh, I, okay. Fedora 15's alpha came out today, and so I was looking at it on my laptop, I looked on a machine at work, uh, I was going to make a video on my laptop because I didn't want to install it on my desktop, <laughs> of course, and the, uh, the virtual machine just would not do it. I mean, would not even let me in. So, no, 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 it, excuse me, the virtual machine let me in, it would not do the, uh, I don't even, it wouldn't do the GNOME 3 interface. Fedora 15 apparently is going to be GNOME 3 by default, so that's pretty interesting. Anyway, I tried it at work. It worked beautifully. Intel integrated graphics. Tried it on my laptop. It actually worked pretty well there, too, with the NVIDIA open source drivers. However, like I said, I don't want to install it on that laptop, especially since I'm going to be getting a new laptop. Oh, did I say that? Yes. Uh, I've got a new laptop coming in the mail tomorrow because uh, any time that I'm on the road or any, you know, going to a conference or even just sitting on the couch upstairs, I would like to be able to edit videos so I can continue to be productive. So I ordered a, a Dell Outlet laptop. I will be doing an unboxing probably on the main channel tomorrow when it shows up. Anyway, uh, yeah, the point is I'm planning on doing a Fedora 15 first look review type thing. Uh, I'm guessing I'm going to have to do it live on the old laptop or even install it on the old laptop because I was going to put it on one of my older desktops. They're both ATI machines. One of them apparently has a dead or dying hard drive. The other one, uh, it's got an awesome video card that something is wrong with because you start up GNOME 3, it looks beautiful, and then it locks up. So it's either bad memory or bad video card or something. And I uh, just haven't had the time to diagnose yet. So anyway, I've been sitting here hitting enter for the better part of an hour now or more, uh, trying to get one of my hard drives in my old, old, old machine from 2003. I guess it's not that old, but anyway. First machine I ever really built myself. So I'm trying to rescue it. So that's going to be fun times. Anyway, I'm probably going to go ahead, uh, since this is taking so long, and grab my laptop and start working on uh, trying to do some screencasting from it because I'm really interested to show what's going on with Fedora, Fedora 15 and I think that you guys and the guys on the main channel will enjoy it as well so uh, look forward to that hopefully that video will be up tomorrow because it's late here it's it's like 10 something there's no way I can shoot edit and upload it tonight anyway Thank you so much for watching. I hope things are going great where you are. Have you heard anything about Fedora 15 that I might find interesting, anything I might have missed? Uh, GNOME 3 is a huge enough change in and of itself, and there's a twist. You'll see it when the video comes out. Uh, I'm going to try to cover as much of it as I can because there, there is a big twist in terms of the alpha. Uh, and uh, Anyway, so uh, yeah, if, if you do see this after you see the Fedora 15 video, let me know what you thought of it here or there, wherever. Uh, otherwise, I don't know. Thanks so much for watching. The uh, the Folding at Home team just hit 500,000 points yesterday, I think. We are within the top 5,000 teams now, which is amazingly awesome. If you have uh, a system that's not doing anything, a system that's turned off, or a system you leave on specifically, that you're not using enough, you could try this out if you want to help out. Uh, the team number again is 201634. It's the This Week in Linux team. I'll have a link down there below that you can check all of this out at on the, uh, the forum post while you're there. If you'd like to register and talk on the forum, we're on there all the time. Uh, well, I don't know. I don't want to say I'm on there 100% of the time. I'm not. But I'm on there as often as I can be. So anyway, I'm going to go work on this, work on Fedora, work on everything else. Thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you again very soon.